What is up, everybody? And we're about to embark on a journey for something that is two of my fascinations at this moment the Sonic 30th anniversary and the Tokyo 2020 Olympic Games. And it just so happens I was looking to find a Mario and Sonic game to play uh, for the Olympics. And my brother, for his birthday, came over and gave me a gift for my birthday, which was like a month ago, which is Olympic Games Tokyo 2020, the official game, official video game. That's the actual title. You have to read it on the side of the box. Uh, but anyway, uh, I still want to make this part of the Sonic thing, and it, they just so happen to give you a Sonic outfit in the game. So going to be playing a Sonic in the Olympic Games. The thing that is really exciting about this game, and I've only played one event so far, but it says on the back here, epic, <laughs> epic arcade action. I don't know if you can see that. I don't know if you care, but that just means that we're about to find a new arcade sports game. And the events in this game, Outfits. there aren't as many like traditional Olympic events as you would expect to see here. I don't know why the option started on outfits. Whatever, that was Olympic the last thing on there. Okay, so we're going to select one player. We're playing against the computer. Don't feel like playing online. But as you can see, our traditional Olympic events right here, like 100 meter, 110 meter hurdles, hammer throw, long jump. Freestyle, swimming, uh, medley, and then, and then we have the the four by one hundred relay. That's about it for our traditional events, and then we have like baseball. And if you can see the preview down in the bottom there, it looks like some pretty good baseball. Basketball, that looks like basketball. That looks pretty slick. Football. Okay, soccer. Um, that looks slick too. Beach volleyball. I mean, this this game looks like it's presenting something fantastic. And uh, since I'm going into this blind, uh, I think I should start off with a couple traditional Olympic events. So I'm gonna do one of these medleys here. They have for the presets. And we're going to do all the track and field events, and then we're going to move on to playing some of the sports. And I think the one that I'm most interested in trying first is the basketball, so let's kick it off with this track and field. And, uh, yeah. So far, the one event I did play, it seems, it seems like it's got the gameplay down. And... I'm, I'm afraid that this game might get overlooked because it's just like a licensed Olympic game. But it just looks good to me. Alright. That'd be easy enough. Flick the stick. Yeah, I'm probably gonna suck at these ones. These these traditional track and event track and field events are kinda difficult. Um, until you get the ideas down. So let's see what a first attempt looks like. Uh, apparently Jamaica's got the superstar. So you can actually make a custom avatar in this game. You can dress them up in whatever you want. I haven't dressed up as Sonic. So let's see how this goes. First try. Alright. Start. pretty good <laughs> wasn't that far from the world record oh I went over the line but you don't want to do that in the long jump don't want to do that all right let's see if it tries to make me no it's so, okay it just jumps me in my next attempt only one that didn't make it Second try. Start. 
Ooh, perfect angle. Let's see if they cross the line. No, nope, looks like I jumped a little early and it's still not enough to put me in first place. Looks like that superstar is still beating. Oh no! Wait, no, I am winning. This isn't golf. <laughs> I am in first place. I'm a fool. Right. Cool. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> so one unfortunate thing is uh, the current setup that I'm playing on. I can't actually hear the game, uh, so I don't know what it sounds like. A little disappointing, but. Whatever. The audience participation did not elevate me to the next level, but you know what? I, I jumped, and that's all that matters. And I got first place. So, good on me. Sonic is loving it. Loving life. So this game actually keeps track of your personal records. So if you're the type of person that likes to actually focus on stats, this game's pretty good with that. It's exciting. Um, this is the only event that I did. Let's see if I can be victorious. I think I can get it. I mean, I'm Sonic the Hedgehog. So, you would think I'd be the fastest one out here. Oh no, we got a jump master. What does that mean to me here in 100 meters? I don't know. Oh yeah. Watching Sonic with real human proportions is just great. Alright, 9.9, .9, new record. We're gonna see a lot of new records since I'm setting them, but I beat my last run. That's good. Also, you may notice that the voice of my character sounds like a Japanese girl. That's because that's what my character looks like. Just tried to make a quick character. And, uh, yeah. Stuck with that one. But you still get my nice little, uh, me avatar up there. Nothing I love more than rotating a joystick. Release. Third round. Release on the pink. Alright, easy enough. Hammer throw was always one that sucked in other track and field games. Let's see how this one goes. <laughs> Man, these stills of Sonic are, are just golden. Second try. Okay, so this slow down the. Okay, we're at least in. I like that. Sixty-five seems pretty far. Sonic seems happy. I like it. What is up, Eli? We got some gold Sonic for ya. I actually, uh, since you're so interested in the gold Sonic, I did finally pull out the Sonic that came with it. It's pretty, pretty big. It's a good Sonic. Put him back. Uh, 
started busting out some of my knickknacks trying to make this de desk look a uh, Farts. That, they slow it down a lot, but that window is so small. But honestly, the fact that I got one attempt that was on the field is a... Uh, damn, he a big boy. Indeed he is. Would it be taller than that in IRL or no? Uh, yeah, I mean, IRL Sonic would definitely be bigger than that. Uh... In my opinion, um, just think about them in Sonic 06 and get the warm and fuzzies. You should at least be like three feet tall. I think realistically, that would probably be the tallest Sonic should be in real life. So, put that how you want it to be. Looks like I got silver on that one. I wasn't paying attention. Lick the stick. So this, this wants me to hold the controller like this. These old old track and field events used to be uh, alternate between A and B, and then you would press like a third button to jump the hurdles. Um, I probably prefer this, but we'll see what happens. I'm a, I'm a little nervous about it. We have the jump master. I look out. There she is. And, and this guy that showed up in his polo shirt straight from work. Master is not living up to her height. New record, but I do not feel good about that one. We're unlocking so much stuff. Congratulations, you're the best ever. I've been declared the winner? We don't... I guess I'm the undisputed champion, so we just yeah. <laughs> you don't have to play the last two events, okay? All right. Um, let me take a peek and see what track and field events we have left there. Uh, long jump, the hammer throw. Do one and I didn't even realize. Alright, so let's let's see Sonic do something that he shouldn't be able to do. Let's watch him swim. So far, this is a very accessible track and field game. But I really want to see how the other sports play. So this is the last uh, track and field event that I'm going to go on. Be as soon as you see. Go. Oh. Oh, wow. That. Well, let's see if that's accessible. <laughs> okay. Uh, be in the water. Keep dapping. Seems like a cool way to handle the turns. So I haven't played a recent Mario and Sonic Olympics game, so I don't know uh, if any of this is coming from that, because the developer that actually made the last Mario and Sonic game went out of business, so no idea. Can't believe I haven't mentioned the Olympics that I have been watching, so I'm going to bring it up now. I... 
The thing I've been enjoying the most is the skateboarding. Japan. I think it's really cool that they've added Literally. skateboarding. <laughs> and I think it's kind of funny that they keep talking to Tony Hawk. Like, hey! And they were actually playing Goldfinger Superman before they were showing Tony Hawk 2. Okay. Oh, this is this is a great idea for this. So I'm alternating sticks. It's kind of like playing DDR in a way. I think I went a little early on that. I like how. I'm wearing a headband right now, and I think I actually need it to stop the sweat that <laughs> I'm building. I suck. But for Sonic, I think that's good. Mayor Leo and Blanik. Blanik the Bionicle. Man, I don't know if anybody else knows what the hell this is, but... There's that sport that's in the beginning of the first Bionicle movie, and that sport would be dope. There was a game for it. Basically like a two-on-two-on-two -on -two -on -two lacrosse-like game. Um, played in like a circle with three goals. Pretty dope. I could also be getting the two on two on two part wrong, but who cares? All right, so we're gonna move on to the other sports. Very curious how this is gonna work out and if it's gonna be good. I mean, arcade basketball, that sounds awesome. I'm really excited, really into it. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, but uh, again, if my brother is watching this on a replay, I really appreciate that he got this for me. Super excited about this. Okay. <laughs> Move. Seems good. Go towards. Yep. Pretty standard. Wide shoot. Cool. Special shots. Seems standard. Uh, it doesn't have like NBA Jam Turbo or anything, but we'll see how we move around the actual court. <laughs> Why is my team wearing <laughs> geese? <laughs> I think it's probably it's because I, I copied the, uh, the team sport thing down the list just to get the Sonic outfit. Japan. And I think it put everybody on my team in to geese instead of. <laughs> Basketball uniforms, but we'll roll with it. Well, apparently I could have posed. Right. You jump. <laughs> Interesting way to have the tip off. Passing seems to be solid so far. Got the ball stolen from me. Probably shouldn't have been passing the ball around as much. Interesting, it didn't show me how to do defense. <laughs> so it, it definitely is a time jump thing. You saw that circle that sparked up at the top. Like it. Like, uh, come on, judo slap that out there. What the hell? That was the quarter? How long was the quarter? Oh, it's less than a minute. There's probably a way to make that longer. Should not have chucked the cross court. 
perfect timing. Sonic with the beautiful layup. MVP. Five points in the game. Oh, it would switch my defender and I didn't realize it. I don't know if I like that or don't like that. Sonic alone from behind the arc. It's good. Sonic and NBA 2K. That's basically what this looks like, right? I'm gonna be I'm gonna be completely honest. This play is awesome. Uh, it's it's pretty simple. So I'm really curious to see how deep the basketball goes. Um, but it's quick, it's snappy, it's definitely got that arcade feel to it. Uh, like I was saying earlier in the stream, I really hope that this game does not get overlooked. Rogue has boob bounce in Mario and <laughs> Sonic and... Yeah, I bet she does. It's only realistic, right? Oh yeah, drive into the home. Home? <laughs> Driving it home. I think that's what I meant to say. Third quarter is in the books. And uh, we're dominating against... I'm not sure what country that is. I may have left them wide open. Oh, a big pick off. Sonic from behind the arc, perfect timing. Ooh, okay, so we definitely know that the perfect timing isn't a guaranteed shot. I was covered that time. So that's good to know. Because that's one of the flaws of like the, the remake of NBA Jam. Is like if you take Ray Allen and you get perfect timing, you're just gonna hit the three every time. Alright, so, in that super short game, that was really fun. Uh, advance to the semifinals. Let's do it. I want to play more basketball, that was good. Well, look how far away our basketball is from the center of Tokyo. We're like basically in the outskirts. Did I get Sonic Riders yet? Um, I could make that easily happen. Uh, I just haven't done the process for that. I've been having issues trying to find a way of getting Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. Um, so, yeah, since I'm streaming an Olympics game, I probably will try to get, or, uh, get the Riders game going. <laughs> Facing off against the Netherlands. Sonic looks like he just went straight around all the defenders. They were not interested in stopping him. His, his moves were amazing. I thought I was Sonic. Them switching off in certain situations on defense is not super welcomed. I wonder if that can be changed. Because right there, I was going to go for the rebound with Sonic. Luckily, it was picked up, but... So I actually meant to play Sonic Riders a little bit earlier, like last week. Um, and then... When I did the stream with Sean, I was completely wiped out, and I did not bother to do anything. So, there's that. 
That stream took me out for like two days, basically. Ooh, the Netherlands threw it out of bounds. Not good for the Netherlands there. Ooh, the pass is missed. But the team picks it up and lays it right in. Surprised that they're not, like, going for dunks. Oh, there's my special leader. I just realized that I've been ignoring that. A little late, but it's good. So the, the one thing to really note about this is I played a lot of bad basketball games before. And this this feels good. Um, as far as like the level of good, that would require a lot more play. But it there's not any jank that I really feel other than like the weird defender thing. I'm gonna say this is really solid. Sonic can't grab the ball. So yeah, like my <laughs> my ADD is not prepared to have the defender be switched for me automatically. I don't know why the line lights up like that. But Sonic lights up the line like a champion. Oh, it looks like the game might have been a little bit longer. It just scores a lot higher. I wonder how long the fun is. Oh, what a putback. I can't even be mad about that one. Japan up nine. And it looks like we're gonna take this one home. We're moving on to the finals, baby. Man, I love this costume. <laughs> In the uh the video game news sites that I follow, really the only thing that they noted about this game was the fact that you could use this costume. Which makes me really disappointed that they didn't play this game. <laughs> well, let's advance to the finals. The transitions in this game are so slick. I really like that touch. Even that, just like kind of sitting there, and then when the load pops over. I mean, if if this were probably like on the PS5 or something, it would be almost instant. We got some advanced controls that didn't show me. Still, all of, oh, we do have a turbo. We've been turboing this whole time. Why give me the basic controls? Just tell me the whole damn thing. <laughs> we don't want to confuse kids with too many options. Argentina. Playing against Argentina, and they Argentina. have the king, Bernard, and for Alright. Rocking the geese. Let's go. Yeah. Alright, now that we have full capability. Mm. 
from way outside. I don't even know why he was thinking about taking that shot, but I blew the rebound, so it worked out for him. Oh, yeah. Where is the goaltending? Don't even tell me that it touched the rim. That was some bullshit. The finals are going to get tough because the other team's cheating. Change position. Thomas the tank engine on Genesis is a sports game. <laughs> I don't know if you were watching the one stream uh, where I was going through some emulators and I <laughs> played Thomas the Tank Engine. <laughs> that was on Super Nintendo, and I don't know if you're referencing that, but it's definitely a sports game. I cannot remember anything about that game. I totally blew that. That was completely my fault, and I am terrible. Chucking down court to Sonic. Sonic behind the arc a little bit early, but it goes through. Down one. That's the nature of these games. Down a bit. NBA Jam 1916, which I turn it from. I don't remember that. I like it. I feel like you're scratching a part of my brain where I'm like. That sounds really familiar, but I don't, I don't recall. It was probably from that same stream. I remember going through so many of those games. I really should go back and watch those. I don't even know what streams those were on, because those were definitely unadvertised as a part of that stream. Probably like, I, I went through that period where I was playing the GameCube soccer games, and I still have yet to play Sega Soccer Slam. I feel like that's the one that's missing from that collection. Yeah, I, I figured it was one of the games, I just cannot remember the, the actual circumstance. Alright, we're going into the fourth quarter. We're up. Let's see what the winning the finals looks like in this game. So I had no idea who I was because they switched me off. I really want to know if there are like advanced options for this game. Um, make the quarters longer. Uh, change the auto defense. Like right there, I was going to the basket and going to run to that defender and then it switched me to the person near the ball. Late shot! We're still up. As long as they don't hit the three. We got it. We win the finals. Modelo's all around. presume that they are playing the national anthem of Japan. You see the raised video posted on the server. You posted it recently. I have not seen it. I only looked at the uh, Discord like it was very briefly. I just looked at general. Saw that I was mentioned. Commented. All right. So let's see if there is a way to modify stuff before I move on to the next game. I don't see. 
see like an option anywhere. switch that. Maybe they wanted to keep them into bite-sized chunks. So, I'll look into that more. So, assuming that was bite-sized chunk, we'll check out what baseball is like. So that's another one that I'm thinking might be some pretty good gameplay. Yokohama Baseball Stadium. Baseball 1 team sends the battery to the fight. Oh, cool. Thanks for telling me how to play baseball. Right, choose the pitches, select them, move the cursor. Seems good. Special. Play three innings. Seems like an adequate amount of baseball. It does specify three innings, so I wonder if there's a way to modify that. I don't even know what country this is. We're playing against the gamers. Interesting, we're moving the bat around. Maybe not the best. Uh, it's almost like the backyard baseball way of hitting. It does give me a lot of time to adjust to that. Um, but trying to hit the direction that he wants is interesting. That was a quick inning. I suck at baseball games, so that makes sense. The only one that I'm decent at is Mario Baseball. Well, we got Sonic on the mound. Don't know what pitch I selected and threw it straight down. The is that? Oh, it's kilometers. Okay. All right. Selecting the pitch. Uh, an accident. One and one. I feel like they have some interesting Two ideas here. I like how quickly the. Two -two. The at bats take. Or in between pitches. We don't even bother to throw me the ball. Three and We're still in our geese, so we're definitely wearing those because I uh, I just copied the team thing. Because you had to, like, select the outfit for every single sport. Um, and I think the first team sport was, like, judo or something like that. Okay. A bunt! Got there in time. The best hedgehog around. The stakes are high. I really don't care if they beat me in this. Um, so baseball not clicking with me as much as basketball was. It does seem good still. It's just I don't really like baseball. That's just what it comes down to. Oh, and one. 
I would say that uh, the choices for making baseball still kind of complicated for me a little too much. Just because it's kind of kind of clunky moving the bat around like that. It's not smooth. It moves on a grid. I'm just mentally smooth with everything I accident. I was gonna swing at that, but it was so fast that I didn't even get a chance to. Straight to the second baseman. So it works. Way too early. Prepared for the fastball. Brought the change up. It does look like you can move it after you throw the pitch, because you just did that. Anyway. Sports for Nintendo Next Gen. <laughs> you know, actually, bringing up Wii Sports does uh, bring up a, a tragically unstreamed game on the channel. It's probably like one of the most important games in Nintendo history because uh, it's really what sold the Wii. I just recently found out that I have it. It's, it was sitting in a in a Wii game. It was, oh, it was sitting in a, the Sonic uh, tennis game. Sega, whatever the hell. <laughs> oh, Yamazaki is going to be the one that's going to get this home run for me. I'm just gonna. Oh, I don't have special. Yeah. Come on! A little gapper. Can't get to it. Nice I really do think they should revisit the Wii Sports thing for Switch. Like with the Joy Cons, I feel like you could do motion controls even better. I'm playing Skyward Sword right now, and it does do a really good job of doing that, like, one-to-one -one sword feel. Uh, granted, I would much rather not have to play a Zelda game with motion controls, but I am still playing it that way anyway, because the way they adapted the motion controls is not my favorite. Owen 2 No! Don't throw the special ball! Alright, good. We got Sonic up at the plate again. He's gonna change this game. He's gonna turn it all around. I just have zero patience for baseball. I'm not fit, fit to play baseball. <laughs> Just uh, give me another sport. I'm done. If they don't score in this inning, I'm just gonna call it quits. Change up down the middle. So it turns out baseball is still baseball, and uh, I'm very distracted. I'm a 
just want to end it anyway. I'm just gonna end it. I don't think anybody was invested in watching me lose in baseball. Alright, so we played baseball, we played basketball. Um, let's move to a sport that I like playing. play table tennis actually. We're gonna play regular tennis, but I think table tennis is fantastic. Okay. Okay. I'm not gonna hate it until I try it. First to seven. We got Ficus over here. Miracle Maker. What the hell does that mean? Start the rookie to serve. Love all. Okay, okay. No. Right? I honestly think the main problem here is I'm sucking. Or maybe it's just that good to be the miracle maker. Solid volley on my side. Really glad that I was able to hold it up as as well as I did. feel and the intensity of those matches watching them. Ping pong is really fun to watch. <laughs> Just because it feels ridiculous when you're watching it and then the players are just amazing and they're so intense. You used to have a ping pong table right where I'm sitting basically. And uh, amazing shot. those matches never got nearly as intense. I don't think we had enough room down here to justify running as far as other ping pong players do. I'm making a big comeback though. Seems like I'm getting a hold of it. Oh yeah. Sonic satisfied. Match point. Mm. Victory. Alright, table tennis, definitely solid. I think that that's great. First to seven, happy with it. Okay. Remember Ping Pong 2K2 on Dreamcast, aka Virtua Tennis 2K2? But with glitch graphics, <laughs> I do remember that. <laughs> I forgot about that, but man, that was awesome. I almost feel like I should go back to that stream just to see that again. That was really cool. And I was just that damn good I could keep playing. Okay, so Let's move away from a net sport, even though that's what I want to do. And we'll try soccer. Or football. Can you play Pong 2K2 again? I don't know if I could replicate that. I don't remember if I played it on my Dreamcast or Tom's Dreamcast. And it was definitely like a system issue whatever happened I don't know if it was the capture card it's it's really hard to say all right shoot fast run I'm sure there's like a seat there's a bunch of secret buttons that they're not gonna tell me and frankly I'm not gonna read them 
Uh, so it's a minute and 30 second halves. Perfect length for my attention span. Uh. Let's do it. This game decides to have the distinction between slime and steel. Oh man. Already a sport that I don't care all that much about. I'm getting I'm getting whooped. Let's clear it down on the other side. Goes out of bounds. But it's only being thrown in. Probably not a bad choice there. I don't really know much about soccer. If that was to my advantage or not. Probably not. One timer there. Wonder if they're gonna make one of these for the winter games. I would be interested. In seeing that. I know for mobile, uh, the team that made Mario and Sonic games, there's actually just Sonic at the Olympic Games. I don't know what that, that was supposed to do for anybody. So this is a sport where I actually don't think it's a good defender because it is like impossible to catch up anyway. Extra time. In soccer. Big boot. We're in extra time in the first half. And I don't think we're gonna have enough to really make much happen here. Get the ball to Sonic. He loses it immediately. Speaking of losing immediately, I feel like I already lost before this one started. Um, as far as soccer games go, this feels fine, feels good to me. I don't really know all that much about soccer, I like Mario Strikers, I like that street soccer game that I played, I'm not talking about FIFA Street, I don't remember what it's called. But that one was fun. I played quite a bit of it. But not really liking soccer that much. Um, there is that one anime soccer game, Captain Tsuba. But I've been meaning to try it. I did recently download the demo to try it. Uh, it seems cool. I want to do it a little bit more. Maybe I'll play that on the channel. But probably just the demo because I don't think I'm going to I don't know if people are interested in watching me just play a demo. But I, don't know, but I, don't, I don't really think that matters. Which is one way I could actually play Mario and Sonic at the end of the game. And maybe I'll sneak that in at the end of this game after I gone through the non-track and field events. Although I am feeling quite close to the So, we'll see what happens. I got a little bit more in me. I'm all about making promises that I can't keep. Oh yes, I should be telling the sprint, which does work. Ah, it's too much mustard on that one. Too much mustard. We're in extra time, down by two, and it looks like we're gonna lose this one. Not surprised. Now the question is, volleyball or tennis? Or 
rugby. There is boxing and judo, but I don't really feel like doing those tonight. I am going to come back to this game and play it again. Definitely with uh, the Olympics happening. I'm probably going to want to talk about the Olympics some more. Uh, this stream is definitely just going to be talking about this game. Maybe I'll just do rugby and then volleyball. And then I'll, I'll, I'll do the Mario and Sonic demo. Just to have like a comparison to the difference between those two games. Not ruling out that I'll play the actual Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games after this. But I don't. I didn't read any of those rules. <laughs> I don't even know how to play rugby. I think I'm supposed to get to the one side of the field. That's probably it. I'm sure the buttons that are important will pop up on the screen. I maybe put, shouldn't have played rugby right after soccer. Cause... Oh no, okay, there's a different perspective. That's cool. Yeah, drop kick. This is kind of fun. <laughs> Yeah! Wait, what is happening? Am I supposed to... Is that how yeah. rugby's played? I thought I was scoring. How do I play rugby? Do I need to kick it? Last! <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I don't. It's good animation. I really wish I could hear. If the sound in this game is good, somebody let me know. Or rather, Eli let me know, because Eli, you the only one talking to me. I don't know if anybody else is there, and if you are... It's cool if you're not talking. You don't always have to talk to me. Especially when I'm playing a new game and it's... <laughs> what is this? <laughs> okay, line out. Did... Did my... Extra time. Okay. What does try mean? How do we, how does rugby work? <laughs> Sonic knocking this girl. <laughs> There's cheerleading in the middle of rugby apparently. More gold Sonic. The craziest thing is, you remember how it sounded the first time I played it? It's back. It's back to full power. I've not opened up the batteries to see if they're horribly corroded. Maybe it was the speaker just had not been used, and the fact that I hit the button so many times, it loosened the speaker up, and then it started working again. But uh, it is a little bit disappointing. But I, I'm also glad that it made it made a comeback, and I also have video evidence of how it used to sound. Oh, it's a blast! Go! Well. Get going. Move. Try. I tried. Wait, that's all I had to do is press up. Going in the end zone is not enough. You have to dive into the goal. I. Uh, 
I want to kick the ball. I failed. Start. Yeah, it was... Yeah! Yeah, we're all we're all disappointed in Gold Sonic's comeback. But as the 30th anniversary of Sonic continues, so will my love for using this coin. So as long as I'm sitting at my desk, this is Yeah. Conversion okay, kick. so the the wind start drop kick. Conversion. Wherever you score is where you kick your conversion kick. Start. I really, I really gotta try playing like that EA rugby game and seeing what the hell rugby is all about. It's not gonna be good, right? So let's see what happens. This this is fun. I like this. Conversion kick. Some, some big wind coming. Let's kick it towards the pole. I just I, that was perfect in my opinion. Start. Let's do it. Like, a more interesting sport than football. Conversion kick. It's just happening. It, it's basically like this. this is happening. Start. So, Extra if time. any of you are confused by what the hell I'm talking about with this gold coin and how it sounded, watch my uh, Sega tennis stream from a few weeks ago. You'll you'll get the gist of it somewhere in that stream. The other team's not even putting up a fight. Yeah, I love that. <laughs> My team is all wearing geese on accident. It seems like something that I would purposely do. No, I was in a rush. I really did not get a chance to do what this game sounds like. I don't know. <laughs> I really know to get. Yeah, I because I'm I'm playing without the sound. I thought I could plug into the switch, um, but it hijacks the sound. Dude, look at all these points I'm acquiring. I feel like I can I can buy like a big sandwich. Olympic Games. Like one that's like bigger than where I have the webcam allotment. Alright, so Can we try BMX? Like what is BMX? Ooh, yes, we're trying BMX. That looks awesome. Rolling around on a bike. Last of dudes, we can jump. All right, cool. I didn't even know that they were still doing this sport, and I'm really disappointed that I haven't seen any of this on the TV yet. On the TV. Australia. Oh no, we got an Australian prodigy. Okay, riders, random start. Riders ready? Watch the gate. Go! <laughs> I just 
jump did not look like that happened. Oh, there he did. That was that was more like it. Run around the road. Perfect timing. But it depends on when you move the Apparently those aren't supposed to be jumps. The ones that have better of the jumps. Oh yeah. Where's the prodigy now, baby? Where's my super cool grinding from Sonic Adventure? You know, that's one of the things that's great about the Sonic Adventure. They took the elements from 3D Sonics and uh wait around at the bleed of sound. What's up, Iceberg? Glad you can join me in this this wonderful uh, arcade style game. I accidentally advanced to the semifinal, so I guess we're just gonna play this. Um, yeah, this this wonderful game uh, with an awful title. Olympics Games, Olympic Games Tokyo 2020, the official video game. That's what it's called. I don't know why they had to make it complicated. Maybe they're trying to appeal to the uh, the Monster Energy Drink, the official game, Dirt Viking, whatever the hell, the longest title in history. I think I exited by blasting the nice. Okay, cool. Um, so we're gonna move on to beach volleyball. So far, every event feels really good. It does have that arcade feel. Honestly, I'd recommend this game. Maybe uh, the MSR, MSRP price of $40 is a little high. Um, but for like 20 I think that's a really good scoop. Monster Energy Supercross. Yes, that's the shortened title of that game. I didn't check the buttons, but I'm sure they'll show them to me. As we do in Japan, we always wear our Gs and our Sonic suits. Start. Ooh, there's the targeting and stuff. Shit. Oh. Great day. Oh. Good. I can't wait to spike the ball too. Except they keep hitting to the computer. You guys. You watch the real one. Is it is that event actually called Monster Energy Supercross instead of just like Supercross? I didn't know that. They're in Pennsylvania not too long ago. I mean, those events sound like they could be cool. I just have never watched them. I personally really enjoy any moments that I can watch the X Games. And uh, that's what's really awesome about the Olympics this year is they've added skate to them. So, as far as volleyball games go, this is really good. I think the only volleyball game uh, it's better as Dead or Alive Extreme Beach Volleyball. Nice. But, I mean, that's it. I don't remember if I've actually uh, played the Mario Party 4 uh, volleyball mode on stream. I feel like I remember doing it. But if I did, I didn't uh, add it to my playlist. I really want to like try to do something cool for the 100th episode, but I don't know if it's an accurate count. 
not everything gets added. Uh, I don't know if anybody even looks at that playlist, but... Yes! It actually is. I remember when it was called Lucas Oil Supercross back in 2009. Well... Supercross are just big solids, aren't they? Speaking of Monster Energy, uh, I started playing Death Stranding, and that has a really weird Monster Energy drink um, advertisement in it. Iceberg says, it's nice they added skateboarding. I wish Tony Hawk wasn't too old now because I'd love to see him do the 900 in the Olympics. The interesting thing is, so Tony Hawk has uh, been doing some of the MDC stuff. He's not doing the play-by-play, -play, but uh, he talks like the host. And uh, he actually competed in the X Games this year. So he definitely can still do it. Um, but if you're looking for like a skater that you may know from playing the Tony Hawk games, Rune Blifberg is actually going to be... Uh, competing in the uh, the park one, which is basically like them rolling around in uh, like pipes or like basically like a pool. Um, the skate comp, or like the the street competition, concluded for the men and the women. And uh, if you haven't watched it, I'm not gonna spoil it for you who wins, because I was pretty happy with the, the outcome. Of that. Volleyball, solid. Great, great job. I'm, I'm having enough fun where I feel like I want to keep moving forward. I'm playing this. What did I hit? I I'm getting tired though, and that's why I, I'm not realizing what the hell I'm doing. Maybe we should try boxing. Let's try it. Yeah, I thought it was cool that Rune Blitzberg is still competing. Uh, Tony Hawk himself uh, pointed that out. Uh, I wonder if he knew that people would know who the hell that is because of the games. Uh, it's funny, too, because when they, they mentioned Tony Hawk, uh, the announcers, and they were like, in his... Uh, Famous video game. Not actually saying the title of the game. <laughs> but that's how synonymous it is with him. I didn't read any of these instructions. Okay, we're, we're punching with sticks. Sonic is apparently a badass. If this game transfers any of my punch out skills. I'm gonna get my ass kicked. <laughs> and the other like Tony Hawk Pro Skater reference is they they played Goldfinger Superman <laughs> um like before the Tony Hawk segments. Which, it's really funny to me. Like, I wonder if someone working in NBC was like, we have to do this, or if Tony Hawk requested it, or, or what. I have no idea. But it's just, it's hilarious for me to think about, like, skateboarding's anthem is that song. <laughs> Uh, Eli says EA made a Super Cross game for the PlayStation 1. Two games, in fact. Super Cross 2000 and Super Cross 2001. We can try those out one day. I mean, I could probably make that happen. If I remember to do it, I could probably make that happen sooner rather than later. Like all the promises I make, I have no idea if I can actually follow through because I said that the next Sonic sports game I was going to play was uh, uh, Sonic Riders. That will probably be the next one. Unless I 
find a way to play a Mario and Sonic at the end of the game. Technical knockout in round two. Win. All right, select the event. The other game that I need to go back to uh, uh, in reference to Supercross is honestly SSX. That the game needs to be played more. Like, it's it's such a good game. Okay, so we've gone through all those sports. On this side, we just have box, or tennis, and judo left. I know I'm gonna like tennis, so I know we just got off of a fighting thing. But let's let's do this anyway. We're pretty much close to doing every single event in this game. So we might as well finish it out. Um, speaking of skateboarding, though, in the Olympics, the Mario and Sonic game actually does have skateboarding in it. So that's one of the reasons why I want to get that one, too. The graph Supercross was ass. <laughs> Alright, I'll stay clear of that one. That one's the one that I think I remember seeing. So I'm totally not reading these. Whatever. In boxing, it seemed to work out for me. I got a technical knockout, so. <laughs> we... <laughs> so this is the reason why all of my characters oh, are in yeah. geese, is because I copied the, the costume from this team to all of the team sports. I think you can actually Japan. edit, like, each person on your the team. Um, if you really want to get that intricate with everything. So if you really wanted an army of Sonic mascots, I think you could First do it. Match. Grab collar, grab sleeve. Got it. <laughs> Just Sonic watching from the crowd. It's like Sneak King. Okay, I don't know what I'm even trying to accomplish with this meter battle. That's why you should read the rules. It seems like I'm winning. My stamina is higher, but I keep making the initial grab. Is that? Okay, that was Keep up. Sneak King, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10! Yeah. Um. Second match. I still never have gotten past, like, the second level on that. It's, it's basically just a... It's Metal Gear Solid mixed with the field goal and kicking in, in Madden. I remember when those games came out, uh, Tom and I did not have a 360, but we had an Xbox. And we got Big Bump in first, and it was so good that we ended up getting the rest of them. Because uh, big, big Bump is honestly a really good party game. Uh, Pocket Bike Racer is alright. It's a standard run in the mill like, kart racer kind of game. Okay, so I gotta get him. Or the stamina ran out. I have no clue. We won 2 nothing, But let's get Sonic up into this ring. Third match. Hands off. Go too far. You have to like stay on the. It's so weird. Just ran out of 
Stamina. Move all the way down. Judo champion. I want Burger King and Smash. If that would just be the king. Yeah, I think that would be the most disappointing final character for DLC. I have absolutely no clue what they're going to do for the final character for Smash DLC. I mean, honestly, I think... The only thing that they could do is just a complete surprise, like, Master Chief, or like, or like Sora, that would make people go, yes, this is a super cool ending. Because I don't, I don't, I mean, Waluigi is an option, but I, I just, we don't need another Mario character. This thing, theme and sneaking, but a remix version. <laughs> Maybe a creepy ass song. Alright, so. I haven't done the medley yet. I was climbing. Or, okay, so. I don't really want to do this relay. I'll maybe do the medley, because the swimming was actually kind of cool. And then the climbing, and then I'll end it with tennis. As long as it's not another Fire Emblem character, I'm good. To be honest, after playing the latest Fire Emblem game, I wouldn't hate it. I know other people would. Uh, but it would have to be, like, someone from Three Houses. Otherwise, like, another character from Three Houses. They're not going to do that, but... The character that I wanted more than anything was Travis Touchdown uh, from No More Heroes, but that's not going to happen. They gave him his, uh... So this stroke is very different from freestyle. So there's like a keeping my stamina up. Looks like we're going into the backstroke. Backstroke. Such a fast stroke can't be sustained. I don't know if I can like recoup my second turn. Stamina. <laughs> right, so we got one turn left. Breaststroke. So I gotta conserve. Losing. Oh, <laughs> I went too slow into the wall. <laughs> no. I'm so behind. There's no way I'm catching up. It's so weird. They didn't do this event the same way that they did the other swimming. I almost came back, but I ran out of stamina, and I'm going to get last place for a bit. <laughs> Travis Touchdown from the Washington football team. <laughs> yeah, um, but I'm really happy that No More Heroes 3 is coming out. I thought maybe that was going to be the next character, or one of the characters, because it seems like what they're doing is they're trying to market games like hey not enough people played xenoblade let's put the xenoblade character in not a pe enough people played arms let's put the arms character um three houses character uh yeah so i don't know what they're gonna do with the last one and i'm excited to find that out right, let's try this one
it's weird that they completely changed the way that they did the swimming for that one. I feel like the swimming for the the first event was better. Tilt. Direction. So this is a new event that they added this year too. It's basically the event for that the guy that like won American Gladiators. The like reboot of that. I want to say it's, he he became an American Gladiator and he literally only did this event. And I think they called him like Jet or something. There's my pose. I can pose in other poses. But apparently you only get one. Oh, so this is a climbing race? Is this how the event actually happens? Ready. That'd be wild. Because it's like literally what they did in American Gladiators. Go. Okay, so... It seems like mostly what this is is you're trying to line up the line with the other line. Yeah, so it... it I don't know what the sound sounds like because I can't do it, but... It has like a weird rhythm game feel to it. Did she? Oh, she beat me. She kicked my ass. <laughs> All right, brag about it. Jeez. Sonic does not look happy. <laughs> but now he does. Very confused, man. Also, the Washington name Redacted will still be the Washington Red Wolves in 2022. Oh, really? Interesting. That's the name they went with? Over the Redskins? I mean, that's a pretty cool name. I like that. I am curious to know what people think of that. But really, am I? Nah, probably not. People are just going to disappoint me. Singles or doubles? I'm going to go with singles. Because I don't want someone getting in my way. Alright, so this is the last event that I'm going to do in this game. I think I will play the, the Sonic demo. Sonic Mario and Sonic, if you want the game demo. I'm sure this plays how I expect it to play. See if we get virtual tennis quality from here. Start. We got a, a beastly return. Speaking of that, I hate that the Indians have to change their names. What are what are they changing their names to? I mean, personally, like, do I think that the team should change their names? I don't really know. <laughs> like, especially with the, like, the Indians. It's, and how, like, pretty much all of their team names are named after like animals or like mythical creatures or whatever it seems weird considering the fact that like <laughs> we called them indians because we thought this was or columbus thought this was india <laughs> um but really like does it matter i don't know I, I really don't want to take a stance on this. Because I don't really care enough. I think it's cool to see, like, new team names and designs. Because I like when they add an expansion team or whatnot. However, I think the Bobcats and the Pelicans are both ass additions. Uh, to basketball, like as far as like team names go, 
I like thunder. The thunder's cool. Um, however, I don't know. I, I kind of prefer, like, the idea of, like, animals. But then, like, you know, the Indians have to change their team name. So, like, why not the Celtics? Or, I don't know. It's just... I don't, I don't know where I'm going with this. I just said I don't know like three times in a row. But this is why I try not to make statements that <laughs> could be roughly political one way or the other. And I'm trying to come up with an argument on the fly. In a position. Because I, I don't know what side to be on on that. I just don't want you to know what side I'm on. Oh. Maybe if I cut off. Shot. Amazing shot. Um, it's an it's an interesting discussion. What would what would they change it to though? Like Cleveland Cleveland's got the Browns, which is like a dog. Washington. the saddest thing ever. I'm not sure what the hail to the Redskins is. If it's a Sega Genesis song, that would be cool. So, the way that the tennis feels is like, it's good, but I definitely think that virtual tennis has the edge on this, but, you know, I would, I would only dock this like a half point for the way that it feels. It's their fight song, but it sounds like it was from Sonic 2 on Genesis. That sounds awesome! The Browns were named after their first owner, Paul Brown. Really, I because th I thought the they have like a dog mascot, so I just assumed that that's what it was. Um. Olympic Games. So I played through all the events on here except the relay. Mostly, I just don't feel like doing it. Tapping buttons and eh, screw it. Let's let's round out the end. Ending on a track and field feels right. Feels right. The Cleveland shit. So that's what I call them. Didn't they have like a winless season? Or they won one game. I don't even remember. That's, that was definitely the, the year of the Cleveland Shifts. Okay. So like, this event feels like it might complicate it a little bit. We'll see what happens! Yeah, they play like dog shit. Nigeria. Oh man. The game changer. He's a game changer. You heard it here. Set. So I think I'm supposed to keep it in that range. A bad pass, so she like tripped and Oof. another bad pass. 
is actually kind of a fun event. I would like to get better at this. Uh, I suck though. But who cares? The Titan should have kept the Oilers name, to be honest. I mean, I understand why they changed it. You won't, they went for the alliteration. The Oilers is, it makes sense in Texas, but doesn't really make sense in Tennessee. Uh, they, they actually did still play. This reminds me of Wii Sports Resort a little bit. I actually never played Resort, um, mostly because it required Wii Motion Plus. Um, I'm sure it was a great game. So I did go through all the events, but honestly, I think I might try the track and field against events one more time. Uh, or at least the 100 meter and I'll do the 100 meter freestyle. I'm having fun with this, and I don't want to switch over to the Mario and Sonic demo yet, since someone new popped in. Thanks for popping in, Pat. It's pretty damn late here. Oh man, I forgot. I need to get up a little. Well, shit. I still want to play the Mario and Sonic demo because I feel like there's some cool stuff to show off there. And then when I get the actual game, that will be really cool. Ah, it's early for you. Well, good for you. We sports bowling. I don't remember what the strike sounds like, so I can't impersonate that. <laughs> Oh yeah, Pat, uh, my general consensus on this game is it honestly is, is good. It has some really cool track and field events, but then it has some some good arcade style uh, attempts at certain sports like uh, basketball, baseball, volleyball, tennis, table tennis, rugby. I, I think this is a really good pickup for like $20. Um, the, the price that it normally is asking for might be kind of steep for some people. Um, but I'm, I'm super happy with this. Everybody's super sonic racing. I don't know why I didn't think of that. Uh, I'm going to do the 100 meter freestyle and then I'm going to... The basketball isn't the three-on-three, three, which is something they did add to the Olympics. Um, I, I'll actually do a basketball game to end on. It is kind of short, but I'll, I'll show you what that looks like uh, after this race. Which, this doesn't take very long. But I do think this is a really cool take on how to do swimming. <laughs> Chinese Taipei. What a mustache. The Hydro Dynamo. Take your marks. Oh, I did not get the jump. Part of the problem is I... So it's like, kind of like a rhythm game. Obviously it's not going to change because the strokes are what they are. I'm trying to talk and then suck and you know I'm pretty sure earlier I was talking to a bit of Apparently I could have done that. Um, the thing that I haven't found in this game, and I'm going to have to look at it, I'll probably stream this game again uh, later during the Olympics. Just because I do think this game is really good, and I think it needs a little more highlight time. 
and I will probably not play it as Sonic the entire time. <laughs> <clears throat> But yeah, the, the weird thing about the sports is they, they are like abbreviated versions. So there are four quarters uh, in the basketball, and they're all 45 seconds, which is kind of odd. Um, so if there's a slider, that would be awesome. But I don't know if there is, because I did not find it. So like, yeah, it says three minute match. So like, you can see down at the bottom, it does say three minute quarters, 45 seconds. That would imply to me that there's a way to change it. I just haven't gotten to it. That late start off the blocks is why we need, why weed should not be McBan substance. <laughs> I'm just tired, man. I don't know what you're implying. Oh, I made a bad pass right away. I didn't hold the, the angle where I actually wanted to pass the ball. Oh. <laughs> My teammate was in the way of the wide open lane. Wait, why are they all in karate outfits? That is because I copied the costumes for the team events from the judo, and it went down to every single uh, <laughs> um, uh, player on the team. Because I think you can actually modify each player on your team, uh, which is really cool. I can see it now. Sonic is about to Shaq style contact poster dunk on someone real hard. Are the Japanese players wearing karate stuff that's <laughs> canceled? Thomas the Tank Engine Olympics. Dang, that dunk rivals 2K. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, this game... The basketball is... It, it's good. Um, my only complaint about it, and I was complaining about it earlier, was... Uh, when one of the other team has the ball, it will switch to your defender that's closer to the one by the ball. Which is not my favorite, but... I... Like I said, I don't know if there are options in this game or anything. I couldn't find them in the little glance that I had. So, the next time I stream this, I will have more of the answers to that stuff. This was basically just my first look at this game. And I'm really happy with it. If I had to give it a score with just like my first impression, it would probably be like an 8. Um, as far as like track and field or Olympic style games go, it would probably be like a 9 or um, I mean, there's definitely, there always could be room for improvement. Um, but yeah, it, it's it's really fun if you like these kind of games. Uh, we'll, we'll stick with the mate. Even if it's considering track and field type game. You gotta get Sonic the ball. He's the only one that can score. Oh! The hell? He didn't even dunk it. He just whipped it in. He jumped up and whipped it in. <laughs> Throw. Right, 14 seconds left. Sonic pulls up with a three. Nobody there. That's how we're going to come out on top, baby.
Not surprisingly, I think, uh, or surprising, not surprisingly, uh, I think the basketball is my favorite event in this. I just want it to, want it to be longer. It's fun. I like getting dunked on like that. Arts Gilmore, that dunk shot. Artist Gilmore? I'm not familiar with that, but I believe you. Close up! Perfect timing, but doesn't go in. No! Get this guy out of here! Oh, yeah, good steal. 10 seconds left for three bit early Sonic just oh man I had to control that jump and I didn't uh, that's why we lost that's why we lost Rio from Samba Del Amigo is a <laughs> I'm not familiar with that character I can neither confirm or deny your your uh Uh, yeah, so that's that's this game at a glance. Um, get back to it at a later date. So I'm gonna switch over to the home screen here and let's go into Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. He's the one in the leopard off. That still tells me nothing. <laughs> Us top female sprinters sent home for weed. But we are to believe Team Jamaica does not smoke weed. Interesting. Looks pretty nice. Yeah, I. it's a fun game. I, I don't know if you were in there when I said it. But uh, I feel like for $20, this, this is like a really good pickup if you're just looking to have fun. And if you're hyped off the Olympics like I am, it's perfect. Um, so yeah, so this is the Mario and Sonic at the Olympics game. Um, I'm only gonna play a small bit of this, but there there are a lot more events in this. Um, the one that I'm really excited to try on the full version is this skateboarding one. Uh, it does have a rugby, table tennis. Uh, it also has soccer. Basically has a lot of the ones they did there. It has this dream racing thing that looks really cool. Some shooting. Some weird karate. But also has this really cool... Uh, um, retro mode. Unfortunately, the demo does not have like a lot of good ones for me to try. So I'm just going to start off with like the hurdles here and I'll probably uh, just play like maybe two or three events and then I'm probably going to call it quits for tonight. Time for some fun. Oh, you showed him the server. I'll check it out um, after the stream. I'm using one of my monitors to play Switch. That's exactly why I can't hear anything because <laughs> uh, it doesn't have sound um, and then so these two Olympic games were actually made by two completely different teams and the team that made this game went out of business which is very disappointing because they uh, they were so consistently existing My boys, Knuckles and Luigi, and my girls, boys. Yeah, they're here. They're all here. Uh, we're gonna play badminton. With buttons. Fucking buttons, man. Time to go.
So, like, uh... The badminton in this is not as good as the table tennis or the tennis in the, uh... The other game. So, like... I honestly think that maybe... Like, all of the events in the other one are solid. Not really watching the Olympics. Every headline I see, though, is U.S. loses. <laughs> um, there is, as far as, like, the total goes, they're not... They're not losing. They're... They're... Because like, they do this stupid metal total thing, and... Really, I feel like it should be more about the golds, and not just the total. But I think the last time I saw the board, they were behind Russia by one. Or no, behind China by one. It was like 11 and 10. And then, um, Russia and Japan were like the other ones that were prominently up there. Japan has a lot of gold medals, which I honestly haven't really paid attention to like what they've done in the previous Olympics. Slam that birdie, baby. But yeah, I don't know. The Olympics has always been a thing that I've watched since I was a kid, and I've always enjoyed it. I love the fact that it's like two weeks, we get to watch these sports that they don't normally highlight, and it's just consistently there. Uh, I wish the coverage were better. It's gotten worse over the years, and I don't have, like, the... I don't have cable, so can't watch all of the things. I'm sure it's better when you can. Uh, but I got Peacock. I can at least switch to that. Don't really want to try any other events in this demo. Other than... Let's... So, the long jump will be an interesting one, because the long jump in... I wish the, the other Olympic game had a better name. Is it... Am I supposed to be running right now? Am I doing something? Is it they didn't prompt me! Help! That shuttlecock and badminton. Mm. Gymnastics, women's soccer, men's b-ball. Man, the U.S. basketball team is effing up bad. They are actually looking like college amateurs or high schoolers. Yes, I did see that earlier. They got, they lost the the French team. I I was talking to uh, my girlfriend uh, before the Olympics started and mentioned that there was basketball during the Olympics. She's like, who's on the team? And I'm like, oh, probably like. LeBron James or Steph Curry <laughs> and none of them are on that team and uh nice. they did a decent jump there, there was more potential than that. and uh Final attempt. they suck Picking up momentum. yeah Kevin Durant is the Defense only player on the team that I know that jump didn't cover too much Badminton is probably the best backyard sport in existence. It's That's a good one. I have played very little of it. We did play it a little bit in high school. Um, I don't know why. <laughs> but it's really fun. Because it's not like we... Oh, right. There's one more attempt. CBT is the best Olympic sport ever. What is CBT? You're asking the right question there, Pat. What is CBT? Take it back. Backyard football is better. I mean, there are a lot of things that I've done in the backyard that's fun. Alright, I've had enough of this. So honestly, I think that... Uh, 
Olympic Games, the official video game, is the better game, just at a glance of looking at that demo. But I'm going to have to actually... <laughs> Cock and ball torture. <laughs> Wiffle ball was widely overrated. I Yeah, I agree. The, the problem with, like, baseball sports for the backyard is you have to have too many people to really pull it off. <laughs> oh, oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. It was totally worth it coming back to this game. Alright, so I am not completely ready to stop the stream. So... <laughs> I'm gonna. Can I just see what. How this goes? I doubt I'll be able to find somebody. On Switch at 3 in the morning. During the Olympics. And this game came out in 2019. It's a pretty old game. I found someone. From Japan. Maybe. Oh yeah, definitely. The name is Japanese. That still doesn't really work. So we're doing a hundred meter. All right. Let's see. Let's see if I can beat this game. This guy online. Let's see if he also wears a Sonic outfit. Lane four versus lane five. Japan. He, he looks like a pretty serious Japan. fellow. Japan. <laughs> He's Japan. not going for Sonic. He doesn't have any of the the crazy outfits that you can wear in this game. On your marks. I'll read the comments right after I lose to this guy that probably loves this game. Has been playing it since 2019. Set. <laughs> oh, blew him away. <laughs> blew away the whole pack. Oh, there he is. Yes. Do you remember when Michael Johnson won the double gold medal in the 200 and the 496? I was like four years old, so no, I don't remember that, but I believe you. Uh, Iceberg says they got. Jackin a fool god himself. Javelin McGee on the team. That's the first mistake right there. I'm joking, it's good to see him make the team. And they don't have any star players. The only other player recognized in Kevin Durant is Zach Levine, and that's only because I know that he is a uh, bull, and he's like the only good bull. Olympic and I don't know any other of the Bulls, which is sad, because I used to follow the Bulls. Just a little more. Right, I'm going to play a little bit more in this game. And then I'm going to call it quits. Uh, so from the chat, what event do you want to see other than baseball? I'm not picking baseball because it takes me Four in the morning for 50% of the country. Bet that. Bet that's true. It's pretty early. It's pretty early. Surfing! Um, there is no surfing in this one. I don't, I don't have the, the Sonic game. Football slash soccer. Sure, we could try that. I... 
was bad at it. Pat remembers uh, Michael Johnson. I said that wrong. They have star players, but I don't think they play well together. I remember a, a team maybe like three Olympics ago. Um, they were really bad at playing together. <laughs> doesn't mean much because I don't remember who was on it, but I remember they got like the bronze medal. It was like the first time that they didn't get your CBT <laughs> comment. It's, I think it's, it's great. Eli. <laughs> you keep up your CBT enthusiasm. They're just playing soccer right in the grand stadium. and they kicked it backwards. Try to move the ball forward. Earlier when I played this, I lost two to nothing in a three minute game. So let's see if I can do better than that. Whether that means me actually score or <laughs> just not let them score. Foul! This is an arcade game. There are no fouls. So, um, as I was saying when I played this the first time, I have no idea what quality of soccer game this is, but I can definitely say that it's another fun. I can definitely say that it is more fun than certain soccer games that I've played. So, it definitely holds up that, like, arcade-ish feeling. It still, like, is a full, a full team, full field. I think the best way to do soccer as a video game is to reduce the amount of players and uh, shrink down the field to like Mario Strikers. Um, there's also this like early Lego game that I have for PlayStation 2 called Soccer Mania. Uh, it doesn't even have the Lego name in the title. Uh, that creates like an indoor soccer game that reduces the uh, field down. I actually should play that. I haven't played it since I was a kid. And I, I did play that one to completion, so I did like it. And that says a lot about its quality. I don't know if it's still quality as far as uh, my adult thing goes, but I definitely like it. I did also play through Backyard Soccer. Which that says the quality of those games. So it was really fun. I should try streaming another one of those games. Uh, it's been a really long time since I touched them. But we're still working through our Sonic Sports games in the, the 30th anniversary. Another Olympic sports is sport is fishing. Is it really? I don't, I, I don't understand competitive fishing. I mean, it is a skill, but like... I, I, like, like earlier when I got stumbled on of what position I want to take on that. I'm just not going to touch that one. Am I any good at the Winter Olympics games? Um... I haven't played a Winter Olympics game in a very long time. I do, when the Winter Olympics happen, I do plan on trying to get the latest Mario and Sonic Winter Olympics game. So, like, in January, I'm hoping that I'll have the Mario and Sonic at the Sochi Games game on Wii U. And that will be the last Winter Olympics game. So, um, that one does have 
hockey in it, which I am excited to give a go. He's falling the shit out of me in this one. Zero zero, classic soccer. Yeah, that's why when this one was suggested, I was a little disappointed. I was I was hoping someone would say basketball. This is this is the kind of sport that will put me to sleep. Um, all right, full time. We did it. We lost by one. We did better than last time, so that's that's a win in my books. Mega Man Soccer is not an Olympic sport and is also a terrible game. I did scream that before, and I'm pretty sure I quickly moved off of it and went to do other things. I like the way how Blaze dances in this game. I bet, I bet it's fantastic. Winter Olympics is not an athletic, and it's mostly hobbies and wealthy people's vacation activities. Yeah, well, I I personally really like um, watching figure skating. Um, I I have been watching quite a bit of that with my girlfriend. Eli's boofing, boofing noses out here. Hockey in that list. Ophelia, Ophelia. The, uh... I honestly can't think... Like, speed, speed skating was cool. I liked watching that. Um, Paolo Antonono. Like that guy. All right, so I think I'm gonna call it quits because I played a lot more of this than I was actually expecting. So let's uh, return to the the best game. Oh yeah. <laughs> so it just it just goes to whatever the last. Uh, you were on so uh or game you were playing that's cool i like that touch it's a good one um so that's gonna do it for me tonight figure skating is nice but when it involves busting a kneecap it's like the mafia yeah yeah i mean that happens it's... i i wish it didn't happen but you know what happens so but anyway um it's late Gotta go to bed. Gotta get up early. Um, for me. I will say though, Sonic was rivaling Curry in the basketball game. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. It was beast of it. Yeah, of course. I, I really enjoy when you guys come in and chat with me and uh, it's it's always always fun. Uh, the next game that I plan on streaming is Sonic Riders. I said that last time, but that is what I plan on streaming next. Uh, I'm going to try to get a hold of any Mario and Sonic uh, Summer Games game and play that. And uh, eventually, I hope I will get the one that I showed the demo of, uh, but I don't have the funds for it. But if I do get the funds for it, hopefully it happens before the... Uh, the Olympics end but you'll see more of this game I am gonna play some more of it in my free time and uh, figure out figure out if there's any more options that we can dig into definitely a good game I I hope other people will check it out yes old Nancy Kerrigan yes indeed so uh yeah thank you all for watching and uh have a good night our dream is